Hi children, today let us do something different, something interesting. Do you like to count? All our learning takes place by counting. Today we are going to do again counting. But here for counting we are using abacus. We will count each bead, put it on the abacus and learn. Okay? It is a very interesting exercise. You are going to put the bead one by one. Enjoy counting using abacus. Shall we? Let's look at our first exercise. I am sure you love it. Look what you have here. This is called an abacus. You got a board here and you got two iron rods or sticks on it. Alright? The first one that's called O. O is for the short form of ones. Ones. All the ones are single digit numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All the single digit are ones. That we put it on the first. First. Iron rod. All numbers placed here are all ones. Let's see how many ones are there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is 6 ones. So we'll put the number 6 down here. You get that? So you put number 6 because in the ones place we have only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Did you understand? Now, the second rod we got and it is written here T. T is short form for tens. T E N S, tens. Now, when you have, when I put here 9, this is 6, no? Then I put 7, 8, 9. 9 beads. Then I put one more, 10. I cannot put 10 beads in the ones place because it becomes 110. So like that we have 110 here. Again we put another 10 beads here. Then it becomes another 10. And that is how we got two tens here. Each of this is 10. 110, two tens. Now did you understand? On the first line, this is one's place. You can only put up to 9 beads. After the 9 bead, if you put a 10th bead, then it becomes 110. That is this. Again, if you put 10 beads, that becomes 210. Now, in this B, in this rod, that is the tens place, I have one bead. That one bead is 110. I have another bead here, that is 210. So, we write down here two tens. 110, 210. What do we write here? Two tens. That is twenty. So total we have two and six, twenty-six. Let's count. Ten, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Now did you understand? Tens place, ones place. Two tens, six ones. Good. Shall we take go to the next exercise? You understood now? Yes. Every bead is one. Okay, good. Let's take the next exercise. Every bead here is ones. You cannot put more than nine. Every bead here is tens. And every single one is one ten, one ten, one ten like that. Let's go to the ones place. Count the number of beads you have put in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven beads. That is seven numbers. So we write here seven ones. What do you write here? Seven one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You write seven one. But in the next rod, we have put one, two, three, four. That means one ten, two tens, 
Three tens, four tens. Four tens are forty. So we write here four. Did you understand? So forty and seven, forty-seven. Every bead in this rod is ten, but every bead in this rod is one. We have four and seven, forty-seven. Four tens, seven ones. Good. Did you enjoy? Let's take the next exercise. Look what we have here. Let's count the ones first. The first rod has one, two, three, four, five beads. That is five one. The first ro rod has one, two, three, four, five beads. That is five ones. So in the ones place, we write number five. Five ones. Got it? We'll write here five ones. Five. Good. Next. So this is one. Now we go to the tens place. In the abacus, the second rod is the tens place. Let's look at the tens place. How many beads are there? There is one, two, and three. I said each bead is one ten. Let's count it now. In the tens place, each bead is ten. So we count it like this: ten, twenty, thirty, ten, twenty, thirty. So we write three here. Three beads. So we write three here. Thirty and five, thirty-five. Thirty and five, thirty-five. Three tens, five ones. Three tens, five ones. One look at the abacus, you know. Three tens. Okay. Did you enjoy? Let's take the next sum. Look. Now let's first count what's in the ones place. That's what we should do. In the ones place, how many beads are there? Count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine beads in the ones place. So we write number nine, which means nine ones. So you write number nine here. Let's go to the tens place. Let's see. How many beads? And each bead is ten. So we count in tens: ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. Five beads are there. Fifty. So we write number five here. So five. That is five tens, nine ones, fifty-nine. Now you know how to count. With abacus, good. Let's take another sum. Let's count the ones first. We are learning to count tens and ones using abacus. Let's count the ones first. One, two, three, four. In the ones place, we have four, so we write here four. That means there are four ones. How many ones? Four ones. Now we count the tens place. I told you each bead is ten. In the tens place, every bead is ten. So we count as ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. There are six beads here. That is six tens. Six. Ten means sixty. We write number six here. Every bead is ten. There are six beads. We write here. That means sixty. Six tens for ones. Sixty-four. Did you enjoy? Good. Let's take another sum. We are learning to count using abacus. Counting. Let's count the ones first. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight. There are eight beads in the one place and we write here eight. What is the meaning? Eight ones. So eight we write here and in the tenth rod we have only one single bead that is ten. One ten. So we write here one. One ten plus eight. Eighteen. This is one's place. This is ten's place. So what do we have here? Ten and eight. Eighteen. One ten. Eight ones. Did you learn? Okay. Let's take another sum. Let's count the ones first. How many ones are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven beads. That means there are seven ones. And we write seven here. There are seven ones in the ones place. Seven beads in the first ones place. Let's go to the next. Every bead, this is the tens place. Every bead is ten. We count it as one ten, two tens. In the tens place, we have two. We write down two. Two means two tens. Twenty, twenty and seven, twenty-seven. Two tens, seven ones. Two tens, seven ones. You learned now? Two tens, seven ones. Good. Let's take another sum and enjoy counting using abacus. In the ones place, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven beads. That is seven ones. We write seven here. Each bead is one, seven beads. So we write number seven, seven ones. Next, we go to go to the tens place. In the tens place, every bead is ten. In the tens place. Every bead ten. So we count ten, ten. One ten, two tens, three tens, four tens, five tens, six tens, seven tens. There are seven beads and so we write seven here. That is seven, ten, seventy. Seventy and seven one. Seventy-seven. Seven tens. So we write seven here. Seven ones. So we write seven here. Seventy-seven, seven ten, seven one. Good. Let's go to the next sum. Let's count as usual. The ones place. One, two, three, four, five. There are five beats. So we write five here. Five ones. Now we go to the tens place. Each bead is ten. Counting tens. Ten, twenty, thirty. One ten, two ten, three tens. We write three down here. That is thirty. Three tens, five ones, thirty-five. Yes, three tens, five ones, thirty-five. Did you enjoy? Let's take another sir, another abacus to help us to count and learn. Look, in the ones place, we have just one single bead, which means we just write one. That is one one. How many ones? One one. Just one single bead. And in the tens place, let's count in tens. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy. One ten, two tens, three tens, four tens, five tens, six tens, seven tens. We write here seven. Seven and one, seventy one. Seven tens. One one seven tens one one. Did you enjoy? Let's take another sum. Look, we are learning to count using abacus. Yes, let's count the ones place. One, two, three, four. There are four beads on the first rod, rod, and we write four. One, two, three, four. We write four here. That is four ones. What is four? 
for once. In the tens place, we have one ten, two ten, three ten, four ten. There are four beads each ten, so we write here four tens. Four tens, four ones, forty-four. Four tens, four ones, forty-four. Are you learning to count using abacus? Yes. Let's take another sum. Look. Ones place, we have one, two beads. So we write here two, meaning two ones. In the ones place, there are two beads, so you write two ones. Now let's go to the tens place. In the tens place, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. How many tens are there? Six. That is sixty. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. Six tens, two ones, sixty-two. You learn to count on abacus. This is ten. This is ones. Six tens, two ones. Did you enjoy? Good. Let's take another sum. Good. Let's count all the ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are nine beads in the ones place. We write here nine. What is the meaning of this nine? Nine ones. So we write in the first place ones place nine, meaning nine one. Let's count the tens place. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two. Each is ten, so we write nine tens. Ninety. We write here nine tens. Nine tens, nine ones, ninety-nine. Each word bead is ten. Here each bead is one. Let's take another sum. <coughs> Look. Let's count all the beads in the ones place. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So what do we write in the ones place? Number nine. There are nine ones in the ones place. Now we go to the tens. We count one ten, two tens, three tens, four tens, five ten, six ten, seven ten, eight ten. So we write eight here. Eight tens is eighty, and nine ones. Eight tens, nine ones, eighty-nine. Are you enjoying it? Let's take another sum. Yes, look what we have. Let's count the ones place. All the ones in in the ones place. Count by one by one. The beads one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we write seven in the ones place. That is seven ones. Seven ones. Now we go to the tens place. One ten, two ten, three tens, four ten. Five ten. There are five beads. Each is ten. So we write number five here. Five ten seven one. Five ten is fifty and seven. Five ten seven one. Fifty seven. 